everyone and welcome to this brief uh, coaching session where we're gonna dive into a topic that is very important for all of us and that anyone can face at some moment of their life and it's staying or leaving at your current uh, workplace. So I know it's a difficult decision because uh, it affects basically your well-being, your future, the people who is around you. But as I've been going through that, I think I can help you with that. And actually using this tool of coaching is very effective. Basically, we are going to make a list of benefits and costs of staying and living. So you can divide your paper, your piece of paper in, in <clears throat> in two lines and here we're gonna an analyze, make an analysis of cost and here of the benefits. So let's gonna start. Usually, I'm gonna write here cost and we're gonna straight away with the staying and with the leaving. So usually the cost of staying comes along with a feeling of disengagement, uh, sometimes it can be even a burnout, uh, experiences in any case a toxic environment and uh, um, a really low quality relationship at work with colleagues but also with supervisor and supervising. So this is what they used to call the black hole. It's a bit of negativity that basically comes across with all these feelings. You can see it here. Okay. Now let's consider the, the, the cost of living. Usually the cost of living comes with a lot of anxiety because that's a transition. So usually the person doesn't feel security about financial status and also comes with something that we don't know. And that's what I call the tunnel. Because you're going through a period where you know you're entering something that is unknown and you still don't see the light out it uh, out of it and here we are so this all these are legitimate concern and it's completely normal to feel some anxiety and stress about this transition um, so you can easily make a list of what is uh, affecting you so let's going to see now the benefits of staying usually it's it's very common that it's going to be the opposite of the post so usually benefits come with the job security, familiarity with the kind of industry, colleagues, friendship, relationships there, and basically is what I call the comfort zone, which gives you a lot of security, but also it comes with the other costs. And here we are. And finally, we're gonna analyze here the benefits of living. Well, the benefits of living, and for this, I used to, I like to use this color. Here, that is whatever brings you passion, is whatever brings you new ideas. Usually there is a lot of creativity and it's just a moment for you to reinvent uh, what you want. For example, if your priority is to love um, a work that gives you flexibility or something that can just uh, make you through a positive environment then you will stay here in this new area and here is what I call life okay so this is a brief exercise that you can do by yourself uh, usually as a coach we are instructed to help you to stick and deal with your current situation but if we work together and working on this, you discover that this is your priority and it's something positive. I mean, go through your go for your real passion, then I will be able and happy to support you with that. Uh, remember that the most important is your happiness and uh, trust your intuition also. So until the next time, please take care of yourself and see you soon.